Here we are at the homepage, transcribe.really.com, and we'll need to sign up for an account. We click sign up. As we can see, it says the first week's on us. Here's how we start our free week of transcribe. We start by providing our name, our full name rather, as it says clearly, our email address, and a password. Sign up. Here we are. We've successfully signed up for an individual transcribe license. This fully functional trial lasts for seven days. We'll start transcribing now. Here we are in a quick tour of some major time-saving features. Let's tour these together. As we can see, this happens automatically the first time we log in after creating an account. So we're going to walk through these features together, these series of pop-up bars and buttons um, to help us understand the key features of the app. Here at the transcribe, it says, welcome to transcribe. Here's a quick tour of some major time-saving features. We click next, and we now see that this particular area is highlighted at the top. It says, select the file you want to transcribe here. We support several audio formats and MP4 videos. And then we click next. Now we see the dictate key or button illuminated. You can transcribe the audio in two ways, using dictation. Play the audio in your headphones and repeat what you hear in your microphone. The dictation engine will convert your speech into text automatically. Next, Transcribe supports dictation in several languages. As we see from the dictation, there's a drop-down menu that says language and help. The languages opens into another pop-up box that says English US, English UK, Arabic, Danish, etc. There are several, many languages. We click next. Now the, the button is pointing to auto loop off. This is a second way that transcribe can be used through the auto loop feature. The button or box reads, this mode will play the audio for a few seconds, pause it for a short while, then rewind it automatically a few seconds before playing it again. While the audio pauses, you type what you hear in the text editor. Next. Now the pop-up box is pointing to a gear. It says, you can set the time intervals for pause, rewind, and playback in a comfortable value suited to your typing speed. That's up at the top by the play bar. We'll click next. Now the box says, and it's pointing to a up, two upward arrows and the F2 button, it says you can also manually control audio playback using keyboard shortcuts, F1 through F6, or these buttons. Next. Now the button templates is illuminated, and the pop-up box reads, you can assign shortcuts for oft-repeated words or phrases using the templates feature. Next. Now the foot pedal has a box pointing towards it. If you have a foot pedal, you can also use it with transcribe. Next. Now the top or menu buttons are illuminated, particularly the transcribe is illuminated. Happy transcribing. If you have any questions, please feel free to shoot us an email with an email address, contact at transcribe.really.com. And now it says that we're done with the tour. So I'll click done. And now I'll end the video.